Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel and today we are going to be checking out the new RB30 DET from Nissan. If you guys are excited for this video, please don't forget to give it a like and also subscribe down below for more torture of content and a set of Corsa coming soon. And without further ado, let's go ahead and buy this thing. I've been waiting a while for this, bro. Tuned RB30. So in comparison to the 2JZ, right? The max torque is 996 instead of 991. The torque overall is 800 instead of 788 and then you can actually like the torque rpm is actually higher so it can make way more power it makes about 200 horsepower more on this setup that we're running right now so we have an inline six big single turbo s14 with an rb30 honestly i've been i've been like loving this thing and people have been saying that the rebuilt rb26 has been really good so with the tuned rb30 coming out I actually think that this is probably going to be one of the best meta engines besides like it's it's going to be great man so if you guys are excited for that you know drop a like share it with somebody and without further ado let's go test this thing and drive it so yeah, we're going to get into the lap here literally I've changed nothing other than just the uh, engine and then um, the force induction it's no longer a supercharger it's a um, turbocharger but man this thing i honestly i love the sound of an rb in this game it's kind of got like a little burble to it which i think sounds amazing but man i'm just i don't know this like with this much power and especially this car i'm honestly thinking this might be the new like best engine because this thing honestly like it creates like the best amount of power and the most amount not like the most amount. We gotta compare it to the uh, uh what was it the Carbon VR38 DT because that's the one that usually makes the uh, the most like uh, torque and horsepower just because of how big it is. They really need to make like a Carbon LS. I think would probably be like you know a good one to make. But um, dude, 500 and or not even 535,000 points, guys. Like I'm telling you, I'm telling you. You guys gotta hop on this thing, right? Rank up your cars and you can get this thing because it, it does take some ranking up. You need it either to be rank 11 or you just need to be super lucky and get it out of crates. Um, like, it really just depends on what comes first for you. But honestly, I'd work on ranking it up because you have more of a chance of getting it like through ranking up. Oh God. You know, it's okay. We reinitiate. It's fine. Everything's fine. Man, I am so, so excited for this engine because, like, not only, like, it's the tuning potential that's, like, open for this thing. Like, it feels like it's limitless. Like, and that's what I like about it. Like, I just feel like I can drive and drive and drive. Oh, God. I'm getting a little too, a little too risky there. But, dude, honestly, this thing, it feels good. It feels good, good. I messed up because I crashed on the first one. I definitely would have had enough points um, if it would have continued on. But, man, this thing, this thing feels good. It is nice to have a contender to, like, the rebuilt RB, or not the rebuilt RB30. That's the new one, the rebuilt RB26. Like, rebuilt, or, like, like the Carbon 2JZ, the BR38, the build SR20. Like, you know what I mean? Like, it's nice to have, like, a contender to the top spots so that now we can you know play with and not every car is the same and that's the problem with this game is there's not enough items in the game so pretty much everybody's drivetrain is the same there's no individuality in between car and like everybody's setup is the same so that's what like i'm looking forward to the most with this is because it, it really just gives people options and that's what i think we're lacking is we're lacking options to be able to like customize the drivetrain especially engines because it's like yes we have a lot of engines but they're all just different varieties of the same one like we have tuned sr20 the rebuild sr20 the billet sr20 like you know what i mean like we have so many different ones that it's like you know what i mean we need like a, a good variety so with this engine just being completely new and completely fresh and honestly really good produces really good horsepower numbers i honestly think this is probably the best engine in the game so far so thank you guys so much for watching this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.